In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the commercial real estate lease analysis tool on rentharvest.com. If you're tired of wasting time with Excel spreadsheets, this video goes over exactly what you need to do so you can start using our web-based leasing tool. The first thing you need to do is adjust the settings to fit your lease. Let's change the lease type and leasing commissions. Now that you're done with the settings, it's time for step two, lease inputs. There are two options. The advanced option allows for more customization when entering in the rental rate, months in the period, and lease area. Focusing on the simple option, let's enter the leasing information from the table on the right and see how this tool works. Okay, now that we're done with the lease inputs, let's move on to the next step. It's time for step three, free rent. In step three, we will enter the total months of free rent, the percentage of the month in free rent, the default assumes full months of free rent, let's set it to half months of free rent, and the month in the lease term when the free rent period begins. Click on the plus sign to enter another free rent period. Lastly, we have to choose the tenant costs that are waived during the free rent period. Base rent and rent increases are selected by default. Let's also select expense recoveries. And with that, we are done step three. Now we move on to step four, operating expenses. In step four, we enter the expenses that are paid by the owner of the property and the base year amounts. We will assume that the base year amounts are equal to the property amounts because that is what typically happens when a new gross lease is signed. Let's go ahead and enter the data. Click on the plus sign here if you want to add another expense. There you have it. In just a few easy steps, you can analyze your commercial real estate lease and quickly calculate key metrics such as net effective rent and net present value. Click on the rent schedule and calculations to check your work. I put a link to the lease analysis tool in the description so you can get started now. Thanks for watching.